Hey everybody, welcome back to the Coin Pusher. Today we're doing a $100,000 buy-in. They only gave us one quarter for $100,000. Oh nice, come on push. Oh yeah. Got back quite a few quarters that time. Let's, let's line them up and get them all in there at once. Get a nice push. All right, we got all of them in there. Hopefully we get a monster push. Come on. Oh yeah, it's going. It's going. They made no money yet, but it's, it's still pushing ahead. Let's keep her going. We got them all lined up in there again. Another nice push. Come on. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Nice, we got a bunch of quarters now. The tower right there is about to go. It won't be long. Get a couple of those towers to fall over though, hopefully. Oh nice, we just got dice. Oh yeah, it's doing amazing. Goodness. I'm glad it's going too, because these one quarter challenges are pretty risky. I'm gonna grab the quarters, tallied up, we'll be right back. Nice, made $175,000. A one ounce gold bar and one of the dice. Some dice we'll get to rolling later on and multiply our winnings. Oh nice, we just got a second dice. I believe there was only two dice in here and we done got them both. Pretty good. Oh, nice. That landed pretty good. We ain't lost nothing to the red shelves yet, besides the quarter. It's not too bad. Let's see if this tower on the left will go. The one that's on the pusher. Oh, my goodness. There it went. We lost a little bit to the red shelves, but that ain't bad. We can manage with that. All right, there was the last of the quarters. I'm gonna grab the quarters real quick and we'll be right back. Nice, made a little over $1.2 million. We got the dice, so we got two dice in total. And seven ounces of gold. We got a bunch of stuff headed towards the gutters. I'm not sure what the best route is to save it. Gonna try the right side. Hopefully it works out for us. Might be better off pushing the, the whole field, I'm not sure. We're going to try for the right side only for just for a moment and see what happens. Seems to be working so far. Just got to watch some gutters on the left also. Right side's clearing up, it looks like. Left side's still behaving pretty well. Getting all kinds of $5,000 chips. Oh yeah, some big old pushes going on. About got the right side pushed over. The big old tower is moving on the right. Once it goes, I think the right side will clear off pretty well. The gutter on the left still hasn't swallowed up anything, so we're good on that. $10,000 chip looks like it might go to the right gutter. Just trying to make up its mind right now. 
what it wants to do. Got pretty lucky and everything on the left just pushing right past the gutter. Also, just a bunch of $10,000 chips. Tower on the right's about to go. Uh, timber! I think that rat gutter's probably clear now. That was the last of the quarters though. Let me grab the quarters. We'll get right back to it. Nice, nah, made just a little under $1 million and two ounces of gold on that round. Let's switch on this left side. I think the right side is safe from the gutters now. Let's keep her going. Got another ten thousand dollar chip. Goodness, I can't believe we got two dice. We got both of them. And that's not a lot compared to some games, but we got them both. We're not gonna have to pay nothing to clear the red shelves off. The towers on the left are moving pretty good, so we probably ain't gonna have to do no buy-ins. Gonna be a good game. Hopefully, a really good game. Twenty grand on the edge. It's gonna stay far left. Well, we might be losing a little bit to the rat gutter, I guess. It's all right. We saved the most of it. with 10 grand. Towers on the left just moved a little bit. Not a much, but they moved. A little here and a little there it adds up. Ten grand about to go over the edge. Oh my, see how far those towers moved that time? Goodness. Wow, we ran through all the quarters already. I'm gonna grab the quarters real quick. I think we're gonna get that 10 grand. Oh yeah, we did. Nice, made $100,000 on that round. That round right there covered the, the whole buy-in for this game, so. It's pretty good. It's one of the quarter challenges, they pay out pretty well. If you can get them to go. They're not very likely to go though, but when they do, when they go, they pay out pretty darn good. Tower on the left is going. It's hanging over the edge. right there. 
Tell you what, them corners are always difficult. But we'll push through that, we'll get them. I hope so anyway. We got a bunch of quarters, so. that next one will go better than that one. I haven't did all right, but it took a while. That's moving along pretty well. Oh yeah. Nice. Two pushes in a row did pretty good. We got four quarters left. Let's get them in. There they are. I'm gonna go down, and grab the quarters, tally it up, and be right back. Nice. We made two hundred and sixty thousand dollars and one ounce of gold on that round. Let's keep her going. Still trying to get this tower on the left. Let's move forward a bunch on that push. Oh, nice. The whole tower went, didn't it? Sweet. I was down there adjusting the loot cam. The whole thing went. Well, let's, uh, let's tally that up. We'll be right back. Nice, made $155,000 and one ounce of gold on that round. Let's keep her going. Stay on this right side. Let's see if we can't get this on the right cleared off. We've been at it a long time, but it's going finally. Resistance has paid off. We're, we're making a pretty good little fortune here. Oh yeah, it's moving. The right corner is moving. Should be getting all kinds of $5,000 chips here soon. Oh yeah. Nice, there went one of them. $5,000 push. Goodness. Oh my goodness, see how far that moved? That is a massive push. Nice, another five grand. Just all lined up. We're about to get another five thousand bucks. There it is. Oh, nice. We got ten grand on that push. Oh, yeah, nice. We got her cleared out. Cleared out as good as I can get it anyhow. There's, there's a gold bar and a $10,000 chip over here. But we can't get that. Not without paying a million bucks and it ain't worth that. So I'm gonna call them back here. They'll put them two dots in right in around here somewhere. We'll roll them down to here. Whatever they land on will be our multipliers. So I'll be right back. All right, they got them two dots in there. Let's push them on down to that lower shelf. 
right down here somewhere. Where they land on is what a, a multiplier would be. It'll multiply all of our, uh, the, the cash value of the chips. We went on everything from two to six. So if it lands on one, just act like it don't exist. That's just the rules of the game. They, they got a number where they want to they want us to lose on, and they, they chose one. But that sounds fair to me. It'd be better than them picking like six or something every time I landed on a six. But like that's a three. So if it would have landed on a one, we could have kept pushing if we wanted to try to flip it. See, that one landed on a one. So we, we'll try our best to flip it over. We can push as long as we want, but if it falls over the edge, we're in the gutters, then we lose it. But it's a one anyhow, so it doesn't really matter if we lose it. We're just trying to get something nicer than a one. Because one is, is zero on this. You gotta watch that three though. Make sure it don't fall over the edge. Sometimes it'll flip over to something lower also. But I'm seeing a six and a five on the closest edges towards us. So it, if it was the flip, it would probably flip to one of those. We'll see how it goes. I can't always get them to flip, but we'll give it a shot. Three's not bad, but five is even better if we could, we could get five out of it. But I'm okay with three if that's all we get is a multiplier of three. We're making a fortune on this game. It's looking like I might flip over to a five though. Or it's going to push right over the edge. Oh my, it's so close. So close to flipping. Can we get it? Come on. I'm trying to take it real easy. I don't want it to push over the edge. Def definitely don't want to lose a three. Oh yeah, can we keep it? I accidentally dropped some quarters in, not knowing in time. Oh my goodness, nice. All right, we totaled it up to eight, so if we got a five and a three, five and a three. So I'm gonna tally the whole game up, and multiply it by eight, and we'll be right back. Nice, we ended up pulling two million eight hundred and five thousand dollars out of there, and I'm dice they totaled up to eight, so we got to multiply it all by eight, turned it into twenty-two million four hundred and forty thousand dollars. That's incredible. Not to mention we also got 12 ounces of gold. All in all, that's not too bad for a $100,000 buy-in. Not bad at all. Well, if y'all enjoy the videos, do me a favor, hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed, and we'll see y'all on the next one. Y'all take care.